In this video, we will discuss about development of endosperm in pinus. Uh, endosperm is the nutritive tissue which will develop in the ovule. Previously, we discussed the structure of the ovule of pinus. Like we discussed that there is mass of parenchymatous tissue called as nucellus. This is covered by integuments. On one side, integuments are not present. This is called as micropyle. This mass of parenchymatous tissue is present like this like this and here one cell will make its appearance this is called as megaspore mother cell because all the cells are deployed so megaspore mother cell is also deployed now this will undergo meiotic cell division meiosis and four megaspores will be produced out of the four three will degenerate and one will remain functional and this functional megaspore will be toward the chalazal end. This part is the chalazal end. This part is the micropillar end. Now this functional megaspore which is haploid in genetic constitution. Now this will, its nucleus will undergo free nuclear division like this. So many nuclei will be produced. And later on a central vacuole will appear. Or it will make its appearance in the center. And all the nuclei will be pushed toward the periphery. Then wall formation will take place like this. We can see here this is the wall formation and endosperm will become cellular. Uh, slowly, slowly this area which is empty, this will be also becoming cellular in nature. So endosperm is haploid, this is cellular and this is having genetic constitution haploid and this is the nutritive tissue. So we can see here this is the ovule, this part is the nucellus and these are integuments and this is the development of uh, endosperm taking place by free nuclear division means so many nuclei will be produced this is called as free nuclear division ultimately this will be filled with the nucellus will be filled with the endosperm tissue and this part is also called as pollen chamber because here pollen grains fall down after pollination they start germinating forming pollen tube and they carries the male gamete toward the female gametophyte so first there is development of the endosperm later on there will be development of the archegonia Uh, so how development of female gametophyte in pinus take place like we discussed this is the nucellus and these are the integuments in this this part is the endosperm so here in endosperm this part is called as archegonial initial now this archegonial initial will divide into two cells like this cell will divide into two cells this is called as neck initial this is called as central cell now this neck initial will further divide like this so this will be divided into two cells later on this nucleus will divide into two nuclei like here this is ventral canal nucleus and this is the egg nucleus and this next cells which are two in number now they will divide again by transverse division to form two tires of four cells each two tires of four cells each so we will have total eight eight neck cells and this is the lower part this is ventral canal cell and this is the egg cell and this is the mature archegonium which will develop into the endospermic part like here this will develop here so we can see here this in here archegonia will develop like this so in endosperm archegonium will develop and archegonium will have egg cell and this is called as female gametophyte so this is the development of female gametophyte like we discussed how egg develop this is called as development of female gametophyte and this is the structure of mature archegonium so thank you for watching my video if you like my video please like share and subscribe